What's up, YouTube? All right, Friday night. Not a lot going on. You know, I bought this tonight to keep as a... Uh, just to keep one in the package, and then I just realized the corners busted off, but this is the only one of these I've found in the wild. So I'll keep that one. I've already got it loose. I'll keep that one on the package, in the package. Um, finally found this, not that I've been actively looking for it, but I've been going after the uh, Retro Entertainment set. And I did a checklist today. There's 115 of them if you count the halos. And I have 85, so slowly but surely. But now that I know where I'm at with it and I know specifically what I need, it might be something I get a little bit more aggressive with here. But uh, this thing is awesome. I'm not into fantasy car stuff, but at the very least, I could see this being a, just a sick wheel donor. It's super heavy. It's actually really cool looking, I think. These wheels would make some awesome off-road customs, though. But, uh, man, you've got your fuel tanks there on the back. You've got a camera that doesn't want to focus. Come on. You gotta be kidding me. There we go. So fuel tanks, you've got the gun up on top. And it's really heavy. This is all die cast, so. And it's all metal base. There's a lot of metal in this bad boy. A lot of cool intricate detail too. So I'll have to pick up all of these Halo castings, which I... I don't care for any of them except for this one, and I don't care for it all that much. The other one, the little four-wheeler thing, would be sweet if it was to scale, but it's not. So, yep, I'm going to get a little bit more aggressive, I think, picking up those retro entertainment cars that I need. Um, I found this. It's pretty sweet. It's not a chase car. It's not a green machine, but I do like this casting from Greenlight. The 69 Boss. This is from the 2016 Hollywood Ornaments. And though it is the emerald green, the same emerald green they use for a lot of the green machines, this is not a green machine. Just something that they did for the holidays. Um, if this were a green machine, it would have green wheels and a green base. I do have a couple of these green machines that at some point I might crack open. But uh, this Boss Mustang is pretty sweet. It's a really cool color. And uh, there's a lot of awesome detail on this casting. Which is why I picked it up. Plus, I just really like the, the lines on it. I think this is one of the many castings that Green Light really did a nice job with. Painted engine with the hood scoop. That real clean white interior. What's our number? 422. Nice. Keeping it below a thousand. So that's a cool car that I found today. Rolls real nice. But, if you watched my video last night, I said I would crack this. I have two of these. The other one is completely mint. This one, the card is really perfect. I mean, it doesn't get any better. There's no bends in the corner. It's a little bit wavy from the glue, but it's real stiff, no creases, just very minor stuff with the edge. Now these are limited to 2004. Before I crack that open, 
take a look here. These are the three loose ones that I already have. I got, I found the other um, old Chevy pickup, the blue and white one, but uh, I'm not going to open that one, I don't think, at least not right now. And then I've got a couple more of that green one that I'm going to keep on the package. I think these are going to be pretty collectible down the road. It's because of how limited they are and how cool they are. But before I open this white lightning, let's take a look at the regular release. This also came out in red. Personally, I like the blue a little bit better. I like the darker color. But you can just see how awesome it is with the detail. Just a big boat station wagon metal on metal rubber tires you got your hitch these these uh tow hitches are not as nice as the green light but i think they're probably a little bit stronger this has an opening tailgate which is really cool i should have brought my other uh white lightnings out I've got like probably 15 or 20, but only a small handful of them have white tires. But uh, this this is a really cool casting. So I've um, a lady local to me found this at Hobby Lobby. These sell for 70 to 80 dollars on eBay, and she sold it for 40 because of the blister damage. And then like five days later. That was on a Thursday, and then the following Monday, I found one at Hobby Lobby that's mint card, mint blister. So, wasn't sure if I was going to open both of them, or I knew I wasn't going to open both of them. I wasn't sure if I was going to open one of them, but I've decided I'm going to. Um, so, this is an Oldsmobile, Oldsmobile Vista wagon. awesome casting and then the boat these boats you can hear just i mean it's a it's solid casting you know i had the dash to my dodge demon in there um but a lot of really cool detail here with the boat But uh, the name of this boat is the Hasta la Vista, which is clever because it's a Vista wagon. So kind of a play on words there. But you'll see the difference between this one and the White Lightning. Same thing with the trailer. Really cool little trailer there. The trailer is all plastic, so... Um, when you compare, if you compare these to the uh, green light hitch and tow, I definitely favor the green light. But these are the next best thing. Not that there's any, well, I guess there is because uh, Maisto does some uh, trailer stuff. They do, actually, they do the, uh, the premium stuff and the cheap stuff, and all of those are pretty bad in my opinion. But uh, let's get to cracking. Let's take a look at this. <clears throat> I'm going to rip it open on camera here. This is the first white lightning I've ever found in the wild. Even though this isn't the one that I did find in the wild. I have cracked quite a few of these on my channel. So that's not a new thing. Before I take the car out and take a look at it, let's uh, let's start with the trailer. We'll do a comparison here on the trailer because basically they're exactly the same except for the tires. One has white tires, the other has black tires. So that is the only difference in the trailer. And then the boat... This is the regular release with basically the same color as the car. And this is the white lightning. It's that pearlescent white. Really cool, really sharp looking. I dig it. <clears throat> but 
I really dig the car. That's what I want to. That's what I want to get to here. These white lightnings are awesome. They look so good in person. Got the Wagoneer and the Mustang from Classic Gold. And basically, this is the same style of car from a detail standpoint. This, I, I think this would come out in the Classic Gold series. With all the trim detail and the rubber tires and all that good stuff. But when you add this pearl white paint to it that just looks frosty really nice opening hood white rubber tires with tread this is a very cool car these are very limited uh, there's 2004 pieces so <coughs> if they did a 2% run They'd be limited to 40, 41 per release. And then you have an A release and a B release. So only probably 80 to 82 of these in total. So it's going to be a tough one to find. There's about one per state. So the fact that I found two of them here, uh, maybe they're, maybe the production is more than what people think. I don't know. I would really like to find this truck, that, that old Chevy truck, and I would trade my other one of these for that Chevy truck if that deal ever came, if that opportunity ever came about. But uh, there you go. Frosty. Nice roller. So that's my Saturday night. So the honey hole is closed tomorrow, so there's not going to be any not going to be any Saturday hunting. Um, I think I'm actually going to take the week off. My daughter starts swim lessons tomorrow, so probably uh, do some responsible stuff this weekend, and then next weekend I'll get back to it. And then in the meantime, I'll just wait. For, I've got stuff coming in the mail. Had some uh, second thoughts on the diorama too, thinking about getting rid of it, starting a new one. All right, well, that's the video. So, you all have a good weekend, and uh, if you all find some cars, post them up, post a video. Let's see what you got. Until the next video, you all take care. I'll holler at the next one.